What up, everybody? Welcome to my channel, T Girl Magic Tarot. Yeah, yeah. Here to do a reading for my Gemini and Collective. <laughs> What's going on, y'all? Welcome, welcome. I didn't do our intro, intro, because look, when I wake up, it takes me a minute, okay? And I I gotta get ready, and I gotta go. I got stuff to do. So I just today we're gonna until this anyway. It's not a big deal. But welcome, thank you. <laughs> For your love, your likes, your shares, your subscribes, everything you do for this channel. And the reason I popped up this way, because I got a download right now in my sleep. So this is exciting times. The energy has shifted. I'm so happy for each and every one of you that have put it put in this hard work. Okay, so um, we are going to do the Gemini song, though, because <clears throat> Spirit said do that, okay, because people... Need those ele those those energies those frequencies lifted sometimes because some of y'all love it some of y'all don't if you don't that's cool just fast forward and this is for the ones the, for the lovers specifically the high vibrational lovers this is mm, for the lover and you let me say this okay we might have to skip the Gemini song because this is a high vibrational reading right now okay but I'm thankful it is T Girl Magic and Collective thank everybody for the new for the new, oh dang, okay, so there's new love in the air, that's what I do want to say, let me just say this, they say, well, what are you saying, just calm down, let me try to get my thoughts together, because I just woke up, and I'm trying to figure out how to deliver the news to the high vibes, you guys are ready for it, though, and it's okay, okay, um, some of you are afraid right now, I want to get the overall energy of the collective, I am going to use the romance angels, because I feel like um, you're ready for love, you deserve love, somebody been doing some moon magic, I don't know, but we're going to see, <laughs> I hope not, oh, Gemini, high vibe, cross watcher, my babies, my high vibe babies, no matter who you are, somebody got blocked and they feeling sad, or somebody's trying to watch in the background and see this some magic work to keep you stuck and trapped and all in your head, because... You have it. Okay, there's battle of the there's battle of the love in the ethers right now. But God has shifted the energy because it's time. Okay, so when it's time and God has set something forth, there's nothing that anyone, no amount of magic that anyone can do to block it. Period. When it's for you, it's for you. If it wasn't for you, then you wouldn't be getting this, and the energy wouldn't be here. But somebody sitting here looking and seeing and lurking because they done did something in the background. With this magic. Now, this can mean anything, but I'm picking up heavy love, okay? You have a lover in the background, and then there's a karmic energy in the background going to a practitioner to try to, I don't know. But regardless, the bottom line is this, babies. For those that were ready for new love, and who wouldn't want love? It's here. Yes, it's here, baby. It's here. Yes, as you're moving to calmer waters, your man is on his way. Or you already been met him, or... You going to meet him on the boat or something about water or he could live at a distance or something like that. But or somebody went overseas to go to a spiritual practitioner and they defeated and sad and shit because they still child. Mm -mm, it's too much going on. Stop doing magic people because it's backfiring at this time and it's not taking a long time. Anymore. It's not. Hell no. Nah. Somebody trying to figure out what the hell had happened. Somebody communicated something and they was like, that's not how it's coming. That's not what had happened. Somebody got ballot and somebody got, somebody got effed up, okay? This is the two of pentacles. Things are being balanced for you, high vibrational angel. Yeah, whatever they work that they did when they went to this practitioner, they feel like a damn fool because, like I said, let no man tear asunder what God has put together, period. Eight of swords. They done put their ass in an eight of swords situation. And now somebody want to come and travel or they want to, speak or they're they're sad in the eight of swords because you're still moving forward and getting this good news or you're getting some something some celebrations some collaborations okay let me give you the channel song that i heard which prevented me from singing the you know gemini <laughs> theme. i got this song i believe it's by martin martin marvin gay okay so some of you have a new love in your energy they're currently in your energy, you have ran across them, you've met them, or they're in your energy right now, and you're scared, Gemini, high vibe cross watcher. You are scared to death 
Okay, I'm going to say high vibe cross watcher because just because you're the cross watcher don't mean that this. Oh, it could be for you too because you're on the other spectrum. You're the one who's sad because somebody's doing magic on you. Okay, to stop you from moving forward to somebody, but they're moving, but that person already has, God already has a person for them that you're trying to prevent and block. So somebody, there's too much magic going on. The, the karmic energy, both of y'all karmics low key, not high vibe. I'm talking to the karmics right now. Okay, you're not learning your lessons. You're blocking each other. You're blocking a love that doesn't want you no more. You're blocking a high vibrational lover. And then the karmic energy, male or female, you are you have a karmic person blocking you from you moving forward to your new love. I mean, to your the love that you want to be with. Okay, because whoever you want to go to, they don't want to be with you on either end of the spectrum. Y'all don't want, nobody wants anybody anymore. <laughs> Except for divine feminine, the masculine still wants him, they, but the divine feminine doesn't want this masculine. There's a new divine masculine has come in to action right now, okay? Um, let me get the song, shoot. It's by Marvin Gaye. Now, this is coming from the new person, divine feminines and divine, the divine masculine, you're the one who wants to go after the divine feminine. So, this is your story, okay? Because you're not chasing nobody, Um you you possibly went through a separation or you're trying to leave a karmic energy that don't want to let you go for dear life for nothing. I don't know what y'all got going on, but her or him don't want to leave, okay? But you want to go towards a divine ma feminine or masculine, however, I don't want to get confused. Sex doesn't matter. Somebody wants to go to somebody who doesn't want them anymore and somebody doesn't want somebody to leave to go to somebody. But anyway, there's a new person that has sparked your interest and you, I feel like, let me get the song. It says, I want you, and I want you the right way, but I want you to want me too, baby, just like I want you. I want to, well, she, what he said, I want to give you all the love, but I want it in return, sweet darling. But half a love is all I feel. So this person's not feeling the recipient, like they're pouring all into you or something. I, like, I feel like you're... You're guarded right now against this person possibly because you're trying to fill them out. But this person's giving you, I don't know, they want to say they're giving you half of the love is all they feel from you. They don't want, he says, and you don't want me, but I'm going to change your mind. So this person's not giving up. They're very adamant, this new person. They say, this is a one-way love, just a fantasy, oh sugar, but share, oh, but share is precious and pure, oh, but love or to share is precious and pure. Don't play with something you shouldn't, you should be. I can't even read my own damn right. I was just trying to write it down so damn fast, so I forgot it. It says, don't play with something you should be in. Something for the old baby. <laughs> don't, don't you want to, don't you want to care? Ain't it lonely out there? I want you and only you. I just want you to love me the way that I love you. So what I'm getting from that energy is like this man who you met or is in your energy really. This is not the old love. This is somebody who feels that you deserve love because they see the, the gift in you or they see the light in you that other people that and there's a lot of attraction there. So you wouldn't be attracted to the one that you don't want no more. You're not even attracted to them no more. So we're not. This is new love. OK, you're attracted to new love. There could be some religious factors, okay? You could, there could be some type of difference between you two, but this person wants you to trust them because, okay, we got two thumb. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Krusty, we gonna block you out, boo. I know you're trying to come through, but it's no, okay? It's love and light, no pun intended. It's okay, go heal, baby, okay? Yeah, go heal, but you got a lot of, oh my God. Gemini, I know y'all tired of it. I'm tired of it. Everybody's tired of it. The whole tarot world is tired of crusty right now because we just want them to heal. That's all. It's not, they're just fighting an uphill battle that's never going to be won. God has already brought someone. It's already been purposed in the plan from day one. So it's, if it hasn't happened, it's already in the books. It's already in the plan. It's going forward, okay? They have someone else in their energy, okay, that is not going to back down because whoever you are, crusty or wounded, you're very wounded still. Yeah, your person's getting, they're, they're sailing away, okay? That, that just, that's all what it is right now. 
Oh, damn. But you, oh, my God. I just, oh, my God. This is sad. It is sad because somebody's feeling, but I just love you. But then somebody that wants to come to you and marry you got they ain't got nothing. They ain't got a pot to piss in or a window to throw it out of. All they did was play. They played too much. You waited on this person. You know what I mean? But now you release they behind and you moving on with somebody else. You moving on with Marvin Gaye. Then they now, now somebody want to have romantic feelings with you. Talking about. But you like, nah, I'm cool. But the, I know I'm all over the place, baby. But stay with me, please, okay? Because I'm getting split fucking messages all at one time and I'm just trying to pick them up before I lose them because you know it's too many of y'all it's not too many but it's a lot and the messages are who they are for you got a new person that's very passionate about you very soon yeah this is could be the one I'm telling you this new person they love themselves they see you loving yourself it's safe to love this person they want to retreat and honey it's going to lead to a wedding uh, you flirting with this person right now because you gave you freed yourself and child you going to go you going to give this relationship a chance cuz this is a soul person this Marvin Gaye person they probably smooth and charismatic too it's like Marvin Gaye i'm telling you this ain't for everybody but this is for a i'm going to say about mm, 30% of y'all maybe 40 Okay, for sure. Put it in the comments. Tell me about your new boo or tell me about this person that's in your energy right now. You know, um, don't be afraid because this could be the one God sent this person towards you because you started loving on yourself first and you released whatever this ex is energy is. Okay, they still got romantic feelings and now they want to come back, but you know, you gone. You gone, babies. You done freed yourself, you magical unicorn. You manifested this new lover that's in your energy right now. And it's going to lead to honeymoon and or children. Some of you are afraid. You're like, no, I'm cool. But God was like, no, I got your soulmate. What's for you? You just need to know the motherfucker. <laughs> you just need to know him. Okay, get to know them. This is your soulmate. Let go of control issues. Yes, you've been hurt. But for the ones that have freed themselves and have done the work, you are going to give this relationship a chance. But right now, you're just like, hmm, I'm just kind of like feeling it out a little bit. That's what you're doing. And that's fine. As you should do that. Okay, you're staying optimistic about your relationship. Okay, you are. This is a new person. A new attraction. Okay, a new new. Because you deserve love. I know that's right because I've been meditating new spirit. I mean, new spirit. <laughs> no. New energy for everyone. You know what I mean? Because God was like, well, I'll bring the new energy when y'all make that shift and transition. Okay, as a collective, and the collective has done that. Yeah, you're in separation, not from the new person, from the old person, okay? The old person want to come back and want you to trust them because they want to reconcile with you, okay? The old person wants you to trust them. They want to rec want you to reconcile with them. Gemini, high vibe, cross watcher, baby, they want you to keep an open mind because they might want to propose to you too, why? Because this new boo is coming through and you about to retreat from this new person. I mean, with this new person. Okay. Both of y'all loving on y'all selves. Both of y'all heart is open to receive and give the highest gift of love of all. So it is actually safe to love this new person. Okay. You guys are flirting right now or you're going to be very flirty or you, you flirt a lot or it's fun and light and breezy and easy and very soon, maybe very, 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 very soon. Maybe you haven't and I feel like this is somebody who you've not even been with. This is something new, 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 new. And all the lessons that you've learned from the previous whatever you've gone through, this is the one. And when you guys link up or whatever you do, honey, this is going to be a passion. Ooh, allow your heart and soul to sing with joy, baby. Let me tell you. Oh, my God. Um, you guys are going to have, um, it's going to be explosive, okay, for sure, for sure. And be careful. Use protection for those that are childbearing ages. I know your mind is not even on this right now. This is all being divinely led and guided from the heavens above. Right now, you're like, mm, I don't know. I don't know if this is going to be the one. And then spirit's like, this is the one. This is the one all my life. I pray for someone like you. Mm. And I thank God that I, that I finally found you. <laughs> child okay but then right now look finances could be a factor though right now maybe you some of y'all are trying to get y'all shit together because you like i want to have a balance equal give and take so you like 
Or some of y'all are afraid because maybe you're not where exactly, exactly. You're trying to heal certain things still right now. But Spirit said this relationship is going to be healing. A lot of passion, a lot of flirting, a lot of playfulness. Okay, it is safe for you to love. Okay, because you're you're make you're like you guys are reflecting each other. You and this new love, okay? So spirits say let go of control issues and let God do his thing. Okay, there could be some differences though, okay, between you two. And that's okay, you're okay with that because no matter, you're still, it's a magnetic attraction. And even if there's differences, because your soulmate usually does differ from your usual type and expectation. So I am excited for you. Let down your guard, let down your hair a little bit, okay? I know it's easier said than done because, but God really wants you to keep an open mind because you deserve love because you're a lovable and God doesn't want you to be caged up. Once you release yourself and connect with this person, a lot of magic is going to be taking place. You're going to receive a lot of spiritual and financial blessings, okay? The love is the highest vibration of all. Okay, so God wants you... Look, this is new. Love, my endless love. So you got a new love. Getting to know each other. Getting to know you. Getting to know all about you. So this new love is you're getting ready. You're they're in there here now or getting ready to show up. And I'm gonna say the next. I oh, don't shit like they're here. Okay, they're here. Let me know if they're here. They're here. I don't even need you to let me know they are here. <laughs> yep, this is true love. Okay, God love. This is because you put look. God has blessed you. Okay. And that's because you release the old. And some of y'all, like, it's in the energy. Some of y'all say you release the old, but that's why the new wasn't coming in your life. So if you don't, and some of you like, I don't even want new love. Okay, well, then you don't have to have it. But still, you're trying to control shit that God has set forward. Your ass still needs to heal. Because who the hell wouldn't want to be in love? This man, this person, let's see what the energy this new love is in right now. Okay, because this is where y'all at with it. And this is a message for y'all to let go of control issues and let this soulmate in. I mean, you should let me love you. What's that song by Mari? Mario? <laughs> okay, this is the person you've been waiting for them. Romance, feelings, the only one, the only way that you wouldn't want this love is if you have not healed from the past because you have been jaded from the past experience of the old love because you thought that one was the one, but your ass wasn't paying attention to red flags. So that's not nothing to do with, you know, what God has for you. That's on your behind. So what energy is this new person in, Spirit Eat? Which is, what would you want me to use, Holy Spirit? What energy is this new person in? They say I could use the same cards, but they, they think that, you, look, they're healing as well. You guys are mirroring each other. They're probably going through a separation or a breakup too, okay? They got the same emotions and feelings, but this person is very balanced. They could be an Aquarius, the star, okay? Very wise and going within. So this is a boss energy. They handle their business. They're loving and caring. Very balanced, Spirit said. Very structured and disciplined, this person is. Okay, they're going to want to move forward with you. They know what they want. The King of Pentacles know what him want. Okay, yeah, and he's going to speak on it and tell you too. So don't be trying to skirt, skirt away and don't be trying to run away and shit when this person comes and tells you, you know, and look, you're going to hold, you're going to be like, I don't know, I don't know. Stop. Stop. Heal. And that's okay, though. Because, you know what? And then you're like, well, another one will come through. But another one may not come. I'm not trying to scare nobody there. I mean, you always have an opportunity. But this is the love. God, it may be a minute, though. Because God needs you to understand. Don't be rejecting none of his gifts and blessings. Because this is a wish fulfillment that's going to balance out everything. So this is like a once or twice in a lifetime opportunity, in a sense. These are for the ones that have healed and recovered and balanced their life. This is a blessing and a gift from God, your wish fulfillment. Because you recognize. what well, Rail recognizes Rail. Okay? You both are healing and Archangel. I'm Archangel. You guys are Earth Angels. Okay? Here to balance out each other and heal the world. You might have a higher calling on your lives where you could be a speakers. You could be leaders. Okay? You're going to be moving forward in this relationship. Okay, but you got to remain strong. This relationship ain't for the weak and the faint. You done been through too much. Why the hell are you going to give up now? This is going to lead to marriage. Okay, this is a contract that God has already set forth. He already called it out. It's already moving forward. And you, you have a crusty person in the background, possibly. It could be anybody. Virgo, 
So I'm saying Virgo because the King of Pentacles is Virgo, and then we got the Hermit right here. The Hermit is mad seeking. They not. Ugh, mm. You got somebody from your past is being nosy, okay? Trying to do readings and stuff on you or tap into your energy. They 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 finding out. They trying to cause. Mm -mm. Look, this is gonna be. Because somebody trying to do magic to stop this Aquarius, this Sagittarius, or Hermit, or Sag somebody trying to stop somebody. But somebody is way too strong. This person is too strong. They're, I did say, and then I say they're a king of pentacles. They're a boss daddy. Whoever's coming into your energy is a boss daddy. They could be no, they could be very well knowledge in the esoteric uh, land. <laughs> in the esoterical knowledge as well. Okay, they are very, they're sent here to, ooh, I heard your protector. What, Gemini High Black Cross Watcher? Okay, so this is a divine masculine that's been sent here from God to be your protector by Archangel Michael. So this could be Archangel Michael, and he, I don't know, now I'm just saying, this is the person that's going to protect you, okay? But you're holding back from this person because you're like, well, I'm healing. Well, bitch, how long you go? I'm not trying to say hurry up and heal. I'm just saying, you have, you're healing every day, okay? Take your time and be balanced, absolutely. But when this person comes comes towards you, don't be standoffish. Be just remain strong. This is your wish fulfillment. Sometimes it can be scary, okay, when it catches you off guard, okay? And you're like, oh, my God, yeah, your past is stuck. They're upset. They wanted to come back, but you got somebody else coming forward, and they're coming forward quickly. This is a person with cooth and class and structure, very kind, okay, um, very, when you're around their energy, you you feel very balanced. You feel like, mm -mm, you start to get dreamy. What? All right, Selena, is you dreaming? Um, mm -hmm, this person dreams about you at night, too. So you guys could have been, you know, not together. I don't think you guys were together together. But I feel like you're in each other's energy. You're probably hanging out, going out, laughing. Um, something, something in communication. And you got an a ex in the background tried to cause some conflict and chaos for this relationship or this new thing going on. They want you to remain single. This person does. They could, yeah. They look. They want you to remain single because they're still holding on to you. Mm -hmm. This person's holding on to you, so they're trying to bring conflict and chaos magic because they don't want nobody to look. They want you to be feeling left out in the cold. They want to end something for you. They don't want this new person coming through to give you the love that you deserve. But God said, let no man tear apart what I put together. Because God's going to steamroll right over they behind. You're at the top of the wheel. They at the bottom of the wheel. And there's a queen of pentacles in the background somewhere doing work. Because her bitch ass or his bitch ass is mad because you moving forward. Yeah, they about to get sick in a little bit. Yeah, this empress, please. And you rejecting offers too? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. These people from there, they ain't going to tell you they going through a tower right now either. But you don't even care if they going through a tower. That's the thing. You don't give a damn. You're moving forward with this King of Pentacles, period. Yeah, and you're going to be happy. You might have a baby. Like I said, be using protection if you guys are going to be doing it because you are going to have a baby. It could be a baby boy, a baby girl. Spirit say that's the truth. Okay, look. Okay, it's going to make you happy. Exactly. It, honey, it, beep, beep. Uh, uh, Hong Kong. But somebody trying to communicate. Somebody is angry. That you're moving forward. Somebody's doing work. They're trying to put in some type of blockage or stop it. But that's too late because this thing is, if it's already moving forward and they can't touch you. Because this is high vibrational energy up over here. Okay? I don't know. The low vibrational energy can't, it can't get, it's too dark. And it's backfiring. So it has to go, it has to return back to the, I mean, that's law. We don't even have to really say nothing. It's just actions and energy being moved around. And if the energy ain't there to be got, the energy is up here. The other energy is down there. And these people are still low vibrational. They don't have no protection no more because you cloaked in the sun. Their protection is all gone, honey. I'm telling you. <laughs> so now they want to come in. See, we ain't going to talk about them. Fuck them because you already know. But the story is the same, whatever, whatever, okay? These people, okay, they're, 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 they're sick. They're sick, left out in the cold. They possibly look at them. They probably did have a fall or some type of accident. God forbid, but that's what happened. Probably a fight broke out and they got effed up. Yup, yup. They had to go to the hospital and stuff. And they know they're under judgment for this. 
they got these people from your past. You've already closed out cycles, and they still are meddling in your business. But anyway, you have a soldier. You have a star, an Aquarius, a Sagittarius energy, a Leo. They could have Leo heavily aspected in their chart. This person, uh, look at them. They really have a lot of emotions. And feel now, this is not a one night stand because usually this is my Casanova, but I'm not getting Casanova from this energy. Oh, this person's passionate about you. They almost kind of got a lot of love for you. What the fuck? You know who you want to... You, oh, this is your emperor, honey. I'm telling you, or your empress, whoever this is, you block them with just a little bit. This is your two of cups, but I get it. You you know what? Moving, you're being spirit-led, so all I can do is say go within. You already tapped in. God is giving you messages and downloads of how to move with this energy, too, because let me tell you, this person, whoever this new person is, they passionate about your ass. They passionate about you, okay? They want to get it. Somebody want to do it to you. But this is your emperor, though, and that's natural. You a high priestess. You beautiful. Make sure, though, because the em oh, honey, the emperor want to do it to you. You know this, though. Queen of Cups, they, they like, oh, hell no. They know it's the good good. They know you got that splash splash. <laughs> if you know what I mean. Okay, this is very grown and sexy. Okay, we ain't got no prudes up in here all like, oh, no, no, because you got here. You got here. Somebody had to be doing something. Let's not get all extra, okay? I don't know. I don't, that's, that's, we don't, that's private. But the doctors and the nurses and everybody was all up in your stuff when he was giving birth. That, I mean, come on now. Let's not, let's not do that. Let's not do that. Uh, we all got here the same exact way. Let's not be like, well, I didn't do this and I was married and I was like this and I was... Shut up, okay? Shut up, because regardless, she was mixing fluids and juices, and it's all the same. You were born in sin, so you can't get around that fact. So you can think I was married and I did it the right way. I was married and I did it. I'm not saying not be married. I'm not saying that I'm not promoting premarital and, um, you know, fornication. I'm not. But I'm just saying keep it 100. Don't be judging somebody else for something else. But... Whoever you are, you are structured and disciplined as well, okay? So you don't get down like that, and you don't judge people. Some of you do judge. You need to stop that shit, okay? And, and don't, just, you know, don't. Because everybody's born in sin, whether you got married or not. <laughs> Period. Spirit say, that's the truth, the, the truth, the, the truth. Because God is the only one without sin. And you got dark inside of you. I mean, come on now. Let's just, okay, I ain't got time to go give another. But anywho. Go within, okay? But I said all that to say this. Go within when it comes. Because you're going to have a lot of passion for this person. And you're going to be wanting. This man going to want to do it to you. But this is your emperor. You're going to get a brand new beginning. But you're going to be a standoffish a little bit. But don't be standoffish. Just take your time. And let me just tell you. Your emperor will respect you. A man will respect you. He sees you. You're the happiness, okay? Yeah. This is your two of cups. And you guys are going to make it. But this is scary because you possibly have been, I don't know, maybe you've been, for some of you guys have been single. Just healing, minding your business, drinking your water, balancing your out, doing your squats, lifting your weights, you know, breathing, meditating, you know, investing in yourself, your business, whatever you have going on. And you're going down, you're like, you're like, I'm cool, I'm moving. But sometimes you got to slow down and smell, smell the roses because whoever this two of cups is, they're on your journey with you. You are supposed don't let don't be like the karmic energy because you know history be repeating itself and it's like it's like things repeat themselves. So this is a lesson for you. If you've learned the lesson, don't you become the karmic and you're supposed to be moving forward with this person as well from the lessons that you've learned to let go and heal and trust the intuition and move within because both of y'all supposed to be moving together. There's something with the world or. You're going to be healing the world, or you're going to be doing. You're going to be moving to calmer waters with this person, possibly having a family. Like this is your one. Wow, your past person. All they can do is spy and look, watch you, watch you celebrate, watch you go. You know, get married, move on, and it's not to rub it in their face while they stay stuck because, and then you don't want to repeat a cycle for the fucking tables to flip on you. And you should have been the shoulda, woulda, coulda. And this person, because this person, tell me about their character and all of that. You know what I mean? Yeah, let's see. Let me grab another. Tell me about this person's character and stuff like that. Because God, this person, they going to make you happy. Tell me about this person coming in character for my, the babies. What is it? Ooh. 
They got, they, okay, I know this ain't, oh, this is in reverse, okay, this whole thing. Was it in reverse? Hold on, y'all, let me get them together. I should have did this card. Well, it was going to come out, it's going to come out. Okay, tell me about this person's character, Holy Spirit. Tell me about this whole person's character for my babies. You know what I mean? Because Jim and I be like, I just want, like, don't get, you can, this person is your fucking two of cups, period. You're going to like, uh, yeah. But let me just tell you this. If you're undecided and you don't know, because sometimes God will send you something. Now, the people that already know, you're going to move forward with this man or woman. You are. You are going to move forward with them, okay? You're going to heal, and this is going to be your wish fulfillment. You're going to feel complete with this energy. Spirit said that's the truth. It's going to make you very happy. You're going to be very stable in that relationship because this is your two of cups. You've done the healing. You've gone within, and you're connected to God and tapped in. Now, those of you that don't, and I'm not scared, you ain't got to do nothing. But you're going to get left out in the cold from this marriage. And then you're going to realize, like, oh, damn, an angel was amongst me to help balance me out. That's what they went to do. Yeah, but I cut their behind out. Yeah, you cut them out because you thought they was a Casanova playboy or whatever. You thought they was a queen of wands in reverse. Okay. Yeah, but, you, but now, oh... Uh, this thing, this person would have been balancing you out, though. And now you're going to be upset and angry because this would it because like love is the highest vibration. It's like a hand and a glove. It feels good. It feels good. Uh, 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 yeah. The only reason someone would reject and be obje objective to love is if they've been wounded and hurt and they don't want to. And that's not that, you know, that's understandable. You don't want to experience that. Who wants to experience pain but no pain, no gain? You have to have go through the pain to know what you want, to make you stronger, to help you heal, to help you have more structure and discipline and coups, to help you know what true love is, what happiness is. If you didn't go through the pain, no gain, and you wouldn't have gotten tapped into spirit as heavy as you are. So, yeah, you got new love here, and that's going to cause a tower, and... I just, God just want y'all to know, like, don't be afraid. Don't be afraid that the way you feel is real love. I don't know. Who's that song? Don't be afraid. But y'all leave it in the comments because it just came in my head and I don't know. I keep hearing the man singing. Is it Terry? Tony Terry or something like that? I don't know. It's an 80s or 90s song. It's real love. Uh. So somebody going to be afraid, but Spirit say, don't be afraid. Go within. Go within because this is the real deal, holy field, because you put in the work, okay? This is your judgment, wish fulfillment, and forward movement. Spirit said, that's the truth. Why are you afraid of God's blessings? Don't be. Don't just live a mean day life, okay? Every day, be strong, okay? But that's all I got for you, Jimmy. Congratulations. Leave it in the comments. What the hell is happening here, okay? I'm excited for you. Love you. Bye.